Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel, or if this is your first time here, hi, my name is Melissa, or Missa. Welcome to the coolest place on the internet as voted by the world, 2021. So, you know, not my opinion. Anyway, today we're doing this look here. I want to play with pink and green. I wanted to play with this lovely pigment. I wanted to put these new lashes on. So yeah, we're going to do the eye look. I do my base off camera because I've done it recently in so many videos, so I thought it'd be super boring. Um, but if you want to just fanny around with me and just put makeup on, like we always do on this channel, because we are a makeup channel, um, and I'm honestly running out of things to say, because I feel like every day we just put makeup on. But what else is there on a makeup channel? Anyway, I'm going to stop fanning around, and we're going to jump into it. So if you want to see me play with some makeup, Put me on while you're hoovering, then let's get into it. This theory even exists is because of a threatening phone call that was made just two weeks ago. I am not drunk, I promise. I'm at Prime with my Revel and Candid, blah 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 blah. I really get bored of saying it, I get bored of editing me saying it. Whenever I prime, just assume it's this, unless I say it's something else. Oh, would you look at that? My battery is already about to die. That's so annoying. Anyway, I'm going to take out, uh, start with lights out anyway. Apologies. I'm not going to lift it up because it's the only black in the palette. I look like Drago Malfoy right now. It's going to go all the way around. Oh, I just can't get the new soap collection out of my head. I just wish I was playing with that today. I'm so frustrated. I tried to buy it last night. Well, yesterday. My payment just kept like loading and loading and I was scared to do it again in case it went through like twice or even more times than that. So I'm just going to wait a few hours and if I don't have a confirmation email or it doesn't show up in my bank account then I'm going to order the collection again. Because I always do a video when Soph releases a new collection. Let's be honest. I'll just take a bit more of that but on like a fluffy bra. All my wee cats are licking themselves really loudly. It sounds like someone is stirring macaroni in the corner. Disgusting. Bludge that out a bit. Why does it look like a pink? Like a purple black? Honestly. Na, 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 na. Oh my love for you. I'm not gonna sing anymore. I feel so ugly today. <coughs> what? Okay, I'm gonna take Reckless, which is like my favourite shade in the world. I'm gonna pop this all the way around. Oh, I honestly, I love the look of the new Soft palette. And I've seen, like, obviously all my sausages are like chatting about it and half of them have like bought it already and are loving it and half of them are like, nah, I don't really like it. But for me, I love it so much. I like the bright colours that she's picked. I feel like I could do really fun looks with it. It's affordable. It's always good quality. So I'm very excited about it, if you can't tell. I'm going to stamp that on and now I'm just going to wiggle my brush around a little. What other things am I excited for right now? I feel like there's something else. Oh, the new beauty based stuff. Like the new like neon palette and then the cake liner palette. I'm excited about that. Not really excited about the like little single glitter pot things or the lip glosses because I'm never excited about lip glosses let's be honest. But they're, they're like the palettes look excellent. I'm gonna take Influence next. Yeah I think that's the two things I'm most excited about right now. I'm just excited as well that I'm excited about a Makeup Revolution release because I've not been excited about Makeup Revolution in quite a while. Um, but they also have like that new CC cream stuff. Why am I just chatting? I don't know, I'm sorry. Um, they've also got that new CC cream that looks interesting and I really like low coverage right now and I don't want to just use my Fenty all the time. Oh, I do want that Maybelline like tinted moisturiser but it's not out in the UK yet. Is it out in the US yet? Yeah, I think it is. I need to have a look. See if it's maybe on Amazon or see if I can get one of my American sausages to get, get it for me and send it to me. And obviously I'll give them the money for it, but it's... Ugh. Like, I would rather wait for something to arrive in Britain and then buy it. I'd like wait three months for it than wait like two months and buy it from America. I know that's so stupid, but it's, my brain's stupid sometimes. I only learned what the square root of things was the other day. 
Greg sat and taught me for ages. I'm bad at maths. Right, drag that out and then I'm going to take a funky followed by Pep Talk. I used this palette recently, didn't I, in a video? Oops. What a shame. Obviously this is another favourite shade. But you know what? I get a lot of comments saying I love when you use the same palettes or like reuse palettes because I don't know, I feel like a lot of, you know, people that are like super big and stuff on YouTube, they only use things like once or twice because they have so much money or they get so much PR that they can always use different things. Whereas for a lot of people like me and a lot of you, we don't have the money to just buy new stuff all the time. So I guess that's why it's nice to keep using things that we've already invested in and then, you know, doing different stuff with it. Anyway, I digress. This obviously looks very messy right now. It's all good. I'm going to take Pep Talk. Peel this in. This look was supposed to be quite nice and rounded and small and uh, it took on a life of its own. As it does when I play with makeup. I don't want it to be quite so high up there. Okay, and then I'm going to take the Hype followed by Ecstasy. Pop the hype down here first. I love pink and green together. Like green is like one of my least favorite colors to play with. Sorry, Teresa. I know that you have thought about ending our friendship over my statements concerning green. It just is. I don't know. I like murky greens. I don't really like this kind of green. It kind of depresses me. <laughs> and then I'll take ecstasy. Slip down. This kind of green I love because it's like acid green is so nice oh yeah okay quickly before my battery dies i'll just grab more of lights out which is the black slip that on this outer corner wonderful okay so i'll just um change my battery blend this out and then we'll move on to the lid and adding some shimmer shimmer because that's the most exciting part of any like eye tutorial let's be honest Right, that looks semi-decent. I'm going to take a tiny bit of my Makeup Revolution eye base just because I think it would be a good idea to use it, so that's what I'm going to do. Um, if you have any questions, ask my manager. Don't have one. I'm just going to pop a wee bit on just as a base for a little bit of shadow. Um, I'm going to take Peppermint, just on that same Morphe brush. Just as a wee base for the pigment. I'd love to see a few more interesting shimmers in the next Carnival palette. I think that's maybe what we're missing a little bit. Right, the pigment. Ooh, the pigment. Ooh, the pigment. I'm taking my NYX glitter primer. I really like this. And then my pigment is Pastel Roses Loose Pigment Shade. Wow. Varicite? Var... Right, I don't know how I pronounce that. Varicite. I am going to put some glitter glue out. Cover my brush in it. Pop it all over. The peppermint shade is kind of unnecessary to be honest. We are covering it up pretty much, but I do quite like to start off with a base underneath what I do, just to have it there we safety blanket you know then I'll just pop my brush into this pot it's like reflex of green and pink it's utter perfection oh look at that what on earth I want to speak to your manager this is too pretty. I mean, I need these glitter flakes in every single colour that pastel roses do. They have one called Peacock, which is sickening. 
and most of my sausages have it and they use it all the time and it really makes me jealous so I'm gonna get that and then they have other shades as well like I just need them all I just want a drawer full of all of these like flaky goodness like oh 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 the way it catches the light are you not entertained and then I'm just tapping around the edges just to kind of spread the glitter flakes a wee bit just because I don't want it to be like a super neat cut crease I want it to be quite like diffused you know but what I did do is a wee cheat is it cheating? I don't think it's cheating but I took hold on let me put the lid on this before a cat jumps up and destroys my life um, I took a little bit of my W7 Metal Flash in iridescent, put it on the back of my big chunky hands, I've got big man hands, took a brush, this is my M506, my beloved, and then just dibble dabble that around the edge, just in the hopes of diffusing it, oi oi oi. Right, I like that. I like that a lot. Okay, I'm gonna take. Where's my brush? Why did I put them over here? I can reach them over there. Lights out. The black. Pop this along the lash line. A little bit thicker on this outer corner, but I'm not trying to do like liner, liner. Just a little bit of liner, but not liner. It's like when you're going out, but you're not going out, out. That's what I'm doing with this the shadow right now. Oh, I'm going out next week. I'm so excited. Do you want me to do a get ready with me for a night out? I'm going on a night out in Edinburgh. Oh, I'm going to be staying the night in a hotel. I'm going to be getting a few cocktails. It's going to be excellent. I'm going to take Nook just on that same brush. Oh, going out for dinner. Going to Maison Bleu. I'm a very excited. And I'll just use that same brush and a bit of the hype. And then I'll take a little brush and I'll dip into Nook again. Tap on that outer edge, what's that? What's that green floating about in my black for? Um, and then I'll actually just keep using that brush because I'm lazy. And a bit of that bright pink. Tap it around over here. Why not? Then I'll grab the hype. Pop this under here. Keeping it very, very simple on the under eye. And then using that same brush, Ecstasy. Pop that down here. Then I'm grabbing my Amazon Hojo highlighter. This is very pink one. This is shade one. It's very pink. I'm gonna wet it though. This will get tucked up under here. These wee brushes are excellent, the M508. I love it so much. I always think if you put it on wet and then go over the top Again, you get more of a, a statement. I might put some like pink glitter under here, I'm not sure. I'll just use that same brush and dip into a little bit of pink matte just to diffuse it a pinch. And then I took my Sheen Epic Liner. This time in polka dot. You know I love these. Um, I just thought I would go for a very pink inner corner. So a big blob of it and then I'll just pat it out a little. Yeah, something like that. So I'm gonna go clean up my fallout, put my base on, come back, we'll do lashes and stuff together. Um just I've done my base in like all my previous videos and it's gonna be exactly the same product. So I'll do it quickly and then we'll come and put lashes on. I wanna use my new House of Boo lashes and oh quickly though. <laughs> 
because I'm clearly forgetting my eyeliner is both Too Faced. I'm using Killer Liner in Killer Queen, which is like this deep plum. I really do like these eyeliners. They are so expensive, but they're so nice. Don't look at my forehead wrinkles. Yeah, girl needs Botox. And then I'm going to use Killer Camo just on this inner bit. I might go in with a brighter green, but I thought they were kind of like murky and a bit sexy, just like me. So, yeah, I'll be back in a mo in a shaky boo with my base on, looking a bit better, and we'll carry on. Why is it so orange? Oh, that's a bit better. Okay, so these are the House of Boo lashes that I'm going to use. Look at the packaging, it's so pretty. These are in the style Boo. And I actually did wear these yesterday, so they're just so so pretty and so affordable. My friend Anne-Marie sent me these and I've been dying to try them for ages and now I've got them. Uh, as always, I'm going to use my Velour Lash Glue. This is my best hack I've ever come across is drawing lash glue onto the lash line. All the way over it and I also just kind of take it through my lashes at the top because then they'll stick to the falsies and it'll all merge into one happy family of... She can't be wearing fake lashes because they look so natural! Eh. But it's lies, it's all lies and deception. And then just take it on, wiggle it around and because the lash glue's there it's so simple and happy and then I've just got like lash applicators that I use to just refine it all clamp my fake lashes to my real ones which is easy because there's glue there just a happy day I mean how fast is that for lash application and I really enjoy my Benefit their real magnet for my lower lashes makes them quite thick and clumpy and that's what I like especially when I've got such a dramatic top lash on I want my lower lashes to kind of match. aren't they gorgeous this is not sponsored by the way my pal sent me them I just love them oh very happy with that yes yes I'm gonna go throw on a lip and that'll be us done very simple fast look but I feel like it's got a bit of punch to it you know Okay, I finished off my makeup. I put on Fenty Unlocked because I just thought pink would be more fun. I was going to do nude, but pink's fun. And uh, put some space bands in. I also put that uh, W7 glitter on the lower lash line just at the front. I just thought it made it a bit more interesting. That's the look. I'm really pleased with that. I'll make, I like, I'm wearing Benefit Cookie. I'll list what I'm wearing if you're interested, but it's pretty much the exact same thing that I've been wearing the past few weeks. Um, I'm really pleased with my makeup. I think it's cute. I'm going to go film another video now. I'm trying to get them done so that, well, tonight is apparently the northern lights will be visible. So I'm trying to get as much done as possible so I can take tomorrow off because the northern lights will be out at like 3 a.m. and I'll be pooped. So anyway, I hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching it. Please do leave me a comment down below. Tell me what you want to see on my channel. Give the video a thumbs up if you did enjoy it. That would be super duper nice. And uh, subscribe if you haven't already. I play three videos a week. Also, my cats are usually on screen, but they're sleeping right now, so you don't want to miss them. So yeah, I'm going to piss off. Have a lovely day, whatever it is you're doing, and I hope I'll catch you on the flip side. Come back. Bye.